it is not just the fact that this is one of the only ca no this is the only camp in the game that you can solo bribe cap it also happens to be very tanky unlike for example a You're goblin sapper on some of the other maps or the hellbats on uh, braxis not only that but it also gives a big chunk of xp and it gives you a second support even if you're an assassin yeah murky's bribe is pretty bad these days actually i would say nova probably it's kelthas time hoan 85 now i want to watch you play kelthas next but a new place time to convection carry Good luck have fun. I don't think you have any chance on that map unless you're continuously invading their camp, which means you're super weak versus a push gun. Well, Falstad is the guaranteed best on Hanamura. And after that, wow. Well, after that best should be brightwing i think what would it take to get you to talk your team into a full marine armor game turin muradin turin rexar tychus reina morales that actually sounds like a pretty good comp we could do that in team league maybe dr dildamesh I know my last help. It actually works out. Except we're taking a nuke without knowing what damage dealers the opponents are taking. So they should take Greyman and I don't know. Diablo. I think that will be best for them. Then they're gonna get like sick all in. Really good damage. Or like I don't know, grey main something. Quack makes, thanks for those, mate. Sorry, we couldn't win that game. <clears throat> Tremble before me. It is Diablo, but it's not grey main, which means we could still do a weed ban grey main. Because that would actually, or do it, we pick it. I. Wow. Yeah. Wouldn't want to have to deal with Lily. Lily mouth. No problem. Why is Greyman so good? Always three shot him with everything. Really? You three shot him with anything? That's what he does to you. Actually. That doesn't make sense. He's got 10 armor in Worgen for him, you know. What is a good composition for Rhaegar? Um, a very tanky, steady warrior, where, so that you can get value out of Lightning Shield. For example, Muradin, Johanna. Or, uh, yeah, Muradin and Johanna are fine targets for Lightning Shield. Johanna pulls people closer to herself to get even more Lightning Shield value. And uh, Muradin actually becomes like a really significant damage dealer as well. Thunderclap slows people, keeps them next to him, and so on. Let's fly. <coughs> and uh, secondly, you would like to have a bruiser, someone like Sonia. Rhaegar has a lot of single target heal, ancestral healing, earth shield, chain heal, and putting all that on Sonia makes her very survivable, makes her very scary. Can you play some Zul tonight? What's a good comp for him? Uh, Zul. Zul pairs up really well with uh, other lockdown and with Chromie because what Chromie lacks in wave clear Zul makes up and what Zul lacks in long distance push uh, harass poke Chromie has and they have the bone prison into the two second delayed route of the bone prison so that Chromie can easily hit her targets they, they pair up really well together also Zul has trouble walking into the opponent 
and just casting all his stuff, he's probably going to die. He prefers that people walk into him so he can get value out of Skeletal Mages, Poison Nova, Cursed Strikes. Chromie forces people to move into him, so he provides some nice peel for Chromie. They're, they're a nice combo, but it's too simple to reduce it to just that. He's also better on a map like Tomb of the Spider Queen, uh, Dragonshire. Maybe Dragonshire is not that amazing. He's good on Tomb of the Spider Queen and uh, Black Hearts Bay, which is not currently in the rotation. <coughs> Hmm. I think I might want Mana Addict here. We've got triple damage. I'm gonna get Mana Addict. Very good. Hope you're ready, cause we start in mm. ten seconds. I think we need Palm. Yeah, I'm gonna go Mana Addict this time. My pleasure. Who's that annoying announcer? Please don't blaspheme. That's Lily, and she is a goddess. To peel there, not engage. The light of the sun grows within the temples. Soon they shall bask in my glory. Two people staying here, you know why? They want to get some sweet, sweet streamer booty. It tastes better than other booty, or so I've heard. There is no reason for them to stay bot for that long. I'm gonna get uh, Netherwind. It's four. And I'm low on mana. But we are off a talent. <laughs> He's been there for a while, that's the funny part. Well, Mana Addict helps a lot for Mana. I know... <coughs> I misclicked the uh, mute, sorry. Mana helps a lot for Mana, not a huge surprise, but still good to confirm it, right? is upside down. Come on. We fall to learn to pick ourselves Hey, at least I didn't lose stacks. You can see this hero, yes, then kill them. <sighs> Do you use quick cast on all heroes or just on He's some? Uh, on all of them, Shadow Crab. There's just a few abilities I turn it off. For example, um, Stitch's Hoop is the most prevalent one. I'm 
gonna go Sun King's Fury. I'll try to make good yeah. use of it. The temple sleeps. Oh yes, and holy shock. I'll we'll see it, dude. Time for a short reprieve. And no one not well for us. Have you been enjoying HCC China? Yeah, I have actually. It's pretty crazy. They play a lot of Uther, Divine Storm. Not what you would expect. They do a very aggressive plays. What you would expect. I really enjoyed the savannas uh, at level one diving behind enemy towers as well. That was pretty, uh, pretty special. And although that's a, a lame example, it is indicative for how aggressive uh, the Chinese usually play in uh, in games. I recognize it from Warcraft 3. It, it's what makes them so dangerous as well. Now, occasionally it may seem funny, but sometimes uh, so dangerous. Like, fly 100%, the uh, orc from China that I used to compete a lot against in Warcraft 3. Sky, they play so aggressive. Fly also likes creeping, he didn't only attack, but just the sense of it, the feel. My pleasure. Anyway, I am not going to be... Choosing my abilities too soon. Good form. Yes, we got the kill, and there's someone else there. I could have gotten away with getting a kill there with fire blast, but I really want to know if it's divine shield. Yeah. Oh god, I should have My done it. Magic flows through the temples. Guardians, do not let these mortals approach them. Oh, oh, oh. oh nice. Oh yeah! You are not as weak as you appear. Sick move by Kara. I feel Twilight Dream coming. The sun lights my path. There goes the port. We're only one level up. We are as five now. My temple's power has been extended. That was a pretty sick fight. He, I think he hit at least three on Hinterlands. Which is kind of important data, because that also tells how quickly they get back their uh, their cooldown. This was not safe, by the way. But I want the globes. And I knew they were on the camp too, so they were kind of close. But I was banking on the fact that they were going to be distracted. Which happened to be true. Guy's greedy for streamer booty. It's real, man. I told you. Good. 
back draw. Such a troll talent. Wait, what did my power blast do? Oh, he has ice block, of course. <laughs> I must pull back. Yeah, I went back draft. I wanted to try. Did he ice block the pyro? He did, didn't he? What a baka. My pleasure. I powered Uther. Oh, really? On full oh, HP, Uther. No, ah, misclick. I I thought I clicked the mouth. The power blast is a really difficult skill shot. Wow, he blocked the Twilight Dream. Rotate past here. You have stolen enough of my temple power. Return to your war heroes. Indeed. There's a lot of soak here. If you got Arcane Dynamo, you must have Pyromaniac. I'll get Twin Spheres. And then I won't use it. I cancelled my own Pyro because I knew it was going to be bad. You are not as weak as you appear. I haven't taken Twin Spheres in ages. It's pretty cool. Oh, I got Arcane Barrier, nice. Let us attack this fort. Yeah, you can cancel Pyro by giving a movement command. We must attack here. I just casually took eight thousand damage from the towers. My magic flows through the temple. Yeah, we should probably push with Guardians. the boss. Do not let these mortals Some uh, power blast poke damage on Falstad. <laughs> we all died it. This is not a defeat. It is merely a setback. Hey, those sports don't grow on 
trees. Or maybe they do. At least no conviction stacks. Uh, we did need some peel for back line, but I think Greyman wasn't there either, so. Hmm. A little bit down in XP. A little bit ahead in fortification. Fort was destroyed. I'm waiting. The sun. Half a level down. Path. Half of keep up. Seems fair. Fight before 20 now. Very good. Or just grab the bruiser. Like, their false thought isn't even split, so okay, we're actually getting ahead in XP. <laughs> we were half a level down, now we're ahead. of my pyro and it didn't even go on cooldown that's interesting greetings friend I love you daddy oh thank you Noxido Diablo's heading bot mid mid bot he still has palm he's dead fine choice Master Flames. Okay, we're ready, right? Indeed. They even left what temple? Diablo was a musicfier. Apparently mind. not. The boss just gives them time to respawn, but we're pretty low. So, alright then. We're actually dying to the boss because Karazin is in here. Jeez. we're freaking going for the core it shall be done of course we're freaking going for the core 
Okay. Alright, we'll just get both and do zero shield damage. I guess that's okay. It's not the end of the world. I mean, I think zero shield damage is not as good as winning, but we would not be certain to win. And instead, we'll get all their keeps, I guess. Or maybe not all the keeps. No, not all the keeps. Welcome to the future. Indeed. Your world is upside down. I want to back. I must pull back. We're just We're still in a very good position. Find something else to fight over. That's good. Twin Spheres is actually kind of cool. Lots of chain bombs. And I blame this failure upon you. <laughs> so be it. I guess they're all missing, so. Got a lot of bonus mana. 1300. We need to kill all the walls so they don't have vision. Next temple phase is one or two. One or two. I think it's random, probably. Thanks, Jakub. Okay, it's two. Oh my god. <clears throat> it shall be done. That's nice. Just push it. There is no other choice. Hey, that was our fort. Uh, our core right? is under attack. Or maybe he should have gone back all along. Well, I guess he could have gone back all along, yeah. <laughs> what? Falsa died to himself? Alright, Anoop should have gone back. Because he is actually still doing it. Safest is just to get top tempo. I know it's not flashy, I know it's not what you want, but it's what we they need. So cool when they explode like that. This is the safest. Oh, big divine star. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> A fine choice. <laughs> I can't believe the boss that went from full fun. life to nothing on the core. Amazing. MVP. Man, I. You know, the fact that two of us pinged 
Nomi Anubarak to go for the core, even though he knew he had to go back. He didn't, and then eventually went back, and he still held, even though they made a lot of mistake. It just, it just screams to me, mistake that we asked him to go for the core. Busan police hover cycle. Ah, nice. Uh, and I wasn't even. This is Hero League solo queue. See, Grubby, you win as Kelsas. Yeah, but like. But how? Is it because of uh, backdraft? Or the fact that our Genji was being a jerk most of the game? I mean, he played pretty fine, right? Only two deaths, seven kills. Diablo having 20k more than than Falsa, same XP soak. That one is interesting, though. Glad that you won. Well, thank you for the very cool donation and request. Hold on, 85. Uther and Diablo have more damage than Falstad, even though he didn't split soak. That part is uh, interesting, I think. Despite having hinted and blast. That's unusual. Uh, I want to I wanna hear honestly from you guys. Backdraft. Pyroblast. Backdraft Pyroblast. Worth or not? And Twin Spheres, because I normally never take Twin Spheres or Backdraft. Now, I want to... I feel a very strong psychological urge to justify the choices spring. and to say why what I had was good. And maybe there was some value in it. But to actually go there and say... It was better than Pyromaniac when you go Twin Spheres or... or uh, what's the other one called? Fission Bomb. That one, I think, will be a very tough, convincing job. Backdraft, yes. Pyro, no. See, I felt the other way around. Your build was awful and you know it. I mean, like I said, I, I feel like I'm fooling myself very well right now. I'm lying to myself. Not that well. I could be lying to myself better. I could actually be positive that my build was the best. I think they're both situation if you need more utility i wouldn't call it better than normal in any way yeah the uh the twin spheres i actually liked it not going for burnt flesh i like that as well but it had to be pyromaniac or fission bomb either bigger explosion radius uh, or or um cooldown reduction I am very happy that I took Mana Addict though, and not Convection. <laughs> Backdraw sounds better for engagement while the others are for poke. Well, when you have twin spheres and you've got two procs of your trade, you can put two chain bombs without losing your um, twin. I mean, yeah, without losing the cooldown on your W, it will be no cooldown. And you get double CDR, so you can cast lots and lots of spells. I don't see Lily on your tier list. Damage build seems good. Thoughts? Yeah, Lily is very good right now. There is actually a bug. Lily won't show up, and the programmer doesn't know why. So, no Lily on the tier list. You know what you did. <laughs> Man. Maybe Falsa tanked the core because Anubarak pretended to go for the all-in and he was like, all right, complacent. Mm 
don't you think you won the engage super hard though yellow flash like you as uther walked into the bush pretending not to know we were setting a trap we blew all of our cooldowns on you and then diablo came in apocalypse us to smithereens Stop it right there. <laughs> there we go. 